first intercollegiate game of Mechatronics football. I play against Ohio Northern University, the Polar Bears. It was definitely a last right. When we came into the game, we're nervous just because you know we've been working on this for so long and we want to see it succeed. Our heads are spinning, trying to take care of all the issues we have during the game and trying to set up plays. The Notre Dame students build the football players as part of their capstone senior design course in mechanical engineering. It takes a tough hit out there. It's a very intense design, build, and test experience. Well, the students get a really good experience with project management, which is something they don't see elsewhere in the engineering curriculum. You can have it. Yes, they have to do the, the detailed engineering work for each robot, but they also have to coordinate across the 12 students who are building all of the robots and then coordinate the robots together to play the game. That's good. Money plays, that's fine. Notre Dame jumped out to a, an early lead with a running touchdown. He's got a man! He's going to it! Then Ohio Northern University came back and actually took the lead. Touchdown, the Notre Dame running back Zippy was much more maneuverable than any other robot out on the on the field. He drives back to pass. First year we had a successfully completed pass in the game. The students went crazy, the crowd went nuts. Yes, yes! It was a, a fantastic moment for the game. As a mechanical engineer, you, know, you really like to build things and you know, see your work you know, realized. To be able to have that kind of time um, be converted into something like that robotic football game where you, know, you got to enjoy it and everyone else got to enjoy it too. It's really a great experience I and mean, it's something that I'll always remember. Final score was 26 to 7. It's been a lot of work and I'm just glad we're able to pull out with a win. One, two, three. Very gratifying for the students who have poured so many hours in the, in the shop building the robots. To have that all come together and, and put on a great show for the crowd at the game is really satisfying for all of that effort. One of the things that I would really stress is that it's very important to work together as a group. You know, it's only by having all 12 or however many participants you have working together toward the common goal that you're really going to get everything done. Yeah.